Yeah, maybe uh, I went too far there. Or not far enough. <laughs> Good evening, ladies, gentlemen, and test subjects of all ages. Welcome to episode two of We Watched It So You Don't Have To. I am Proud of My Beef. And I am Jammer, a.k.a. the Mac Daddy Sloth. And tonight we bring you another masterpiece from the same people that made Mars of Destruction, Skelter Plus Heaven. It is glorious. Um, it's more aliens. Yep. But more, with mechs this time, instead of Power Rangers. More female special forces. Space so has a heartbeat. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Looks like a clown's face on that planet. It probably is. They're laughing at us for watching this more than once. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, are we going to watch this whole thing or are we going to skip around? No, I'll just watch the we should okay. put the uh, scene here right next to the opening of that other masterpiece and see how similar they are. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You'll see notice how the intros identical are the, they are. Yeah. Notice the intros are the same here. Yes. I suppose it'd help if I turn my sound on so I can hear the glorious soundtrack of this masterpiece. This is that. Uh, this is that new avant-garde dubstep. I really don't understand it. You've never heard of it. It's super. It's probably never heard of it. It's super out of this world. <laughs> so out of this world. I don't know. The intro might be the best uh, produced part of this anime here. It absolutely is. The song is. I feel like they about as catchy this as any intro sequence here. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually because um, this is based on a visual novel as well, I think. Yes, there is a I remember right. video game for this. I'm sad that I know that fact, but it was for the sake of research and science. Which is why the intro looks so good, because most of it's the hand-drawn scenes from the video game. Yeah, they just ripped it from the their video game. game. <laughs> the game was probably made by uh, completely different people than this animation. Unlike the Mars is that the font which from Predator, the same people. just in blue? Maybe? I, I think so. <laughs> Royalty free, free frauds? <laughs> I like how they show the entire anime in the opening sequence here. Yeah, I don't know how this didn't get a full 13 episode season. A <laughs> full 13 <Masterpiece>. episode season? <laughs> <laughs> you gotta cram it they all probably... into the... 10 minutes that's left <laughs> they'd probably just reuse the uh the same scenes for literally every episode <laughs> idea factory as in we're out of ideas i don't think they're out of ideas i just think they're they have not, one idea they don't have quality control on their ideas <laughs> <laughs> they did one draft of the plot I'm like that's it we're going with this guess <laughs> close enough <laughs> This girl's supposed to have backstory with him. I like how she's like half his height, too. We need more computer sounds. Beep boop. <laughs> Sir, your mom's on the radar again. I gotta announce his name, because no one recognizes his voice, ever. <laughs> <laughs> you ready for the start of the transitions? Ah, oh, there it is. Yes. <laughs> what was that about? <laughs> to show all the main characters that don't have transition. <laughs> it's their American Idol lineup for the season. <laughs> transition. Now it's time for some archery. Not sure what archery is going to do against giant tentacle monsters. Is she playing Pokemon Go? That's a Tamagotchi, son. <laughs> <laughs> Transitions! Now with butt jets. <laughs> this is the future of Rascal Scooters right here. Let's see what we mean by quality mechs here. Like, that's not going to protect you. Make from your shit. pilot as vulnerable as possible. <laughs> <laughs> Their breasts will protect them. <laughs> More of that composite armor. I also like how as the episode goes on, the breasts just get pointier and pointier, and they just get 
they just care less and less about how inappropriate they're making things look. So that's how they spar and combat train. Transition. Fall over. Transition. Now with showers. <laughs> Obligatory shower scene. <laughs> Gotta fit it in there somewhere. Yep. I'm surprised they didn't fit a beach episode in here somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> they had two more minutes, they might have. <laughs> 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 I remember these rides used to cost a quarter. Now you can ride them for free. It's, it's our high caliber pilot training. Pilot training don't by Uncle with, Phil. They don't come with lube, though. You gotta bring your own. <laughs> I feel like their generic monster thing, they just like were playing Mario and they just decided to <laughs> rip off. <laughs> we don't want to get sued by Nintendo. As you can tell, their uniforms are as much of a formality as is their training. Oh, if I do this, it looks like I'm squishing his head. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Psychological tests to join this military operation are also a formality. <laughs> Training's a formality. Uniforms are a formality. Psychological tests are a formality. The mechs are also a formality. They're kind of worthless. <laughs> yeah, they could have just shot him out of a cannon. <laughs> that would be like a much Shinji more... Shinji finally got in the mech. But it's not a mech, it's a plane! <laughs> <laughs> Ironically, his plane has the most protection out of anything in the sky there. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, they're going to give it a hug? <laughs> it's the point of the mix. Phase one, hug the enemy. <laughs> yes. Spider-Man crawl up that shit. Phase two, my car boobs pointier. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Like, it's, at this stage, it is just blatantly obvious. <laughs> that robot just got slapped in the butt. <laughs> yeah. It got good gamed and immediately <laughs> detonated. <laughs> good game out there, soldier. Slap. <laughs> Why is she screaming? I don't know. Transition! Now with goo people. And more naked boobs. <laughs> Transition! Now with naked there's, pilots. There, there's our beach episode right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best they could do for a beach episode on short notice. Yeah. Sand costs extra. <laughs> so do bathing suits, apparently. <laughs> They never animate that guy, they just do close-ups of him and watch his mouth move. Yeah. Transition! Now with medical prognosis. <laughs> Transition! Now with school time flashbacks. <coughs> Joke's on you, they thought they were normal people. They're fake people. Because it matters. <laughs> These pilots it's, think they're people. It's critical to the plot for some reason. <laughs> Transition, now with searching for the plot. <laughs> you are a mindless soldier. You don't get to think. Follow orders. <laughs> Back to screaming. Transition, now with explosions. <laughs> so, are they trying to siphon gas or chug beer in their training there? What's going on? 
I don't know. Let's see here, which one of these buttons flies the plane? Doesn't matter, push them all! <laughs> it's like, I have no idea how to fly this plane. Clearly. Woman, stop push pushing me out of the way. I don't understand what you just said. <laughs> <laughs> his exact expression. Yep. <laughs> Fucking robots and your bullshit feelings. You don't have feelings, you're a, a goo pilot. I'm not even <laughs> sure what they're called. Wait. Specimens? Do ex machinus? Yeah. <laughs> This subtitle said older brother. <laughs> Transition! Now with LSD! Is this random other girl just floating, sleeping next to her? Yeah, I don't know who that is. It doesn't matter. Transition! Now with out of body experience. I wish her head would explode. <laughs> that would make this better. <laughs> It's like they're trying to replicate that scene from Star Trek 1, the motion picture. Yeah. It's possible. Alright, here is the fight scene of the century. And cut. <laughs> oh, Transition. yeah, I totally know what happened there. Just God damn it, Lynn. Giant, <laughs> giant blooper just fucking fell over. They had like a conversation, he's like, I'm just gonna kill myself rather than continue <laughs> to talk to you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know, that sushi had robot girls inside of it. I don't think it's good anymore. <laughs> Do these girls come with a warranty? Are they like needing a factory recall? <laughs> he's deleting his son my, from his contact get list. Get my receipt from Best Buy for these robot girls. He's looking at his phone, he's like, you're out of my... My circle. <laughs> You're not on the family plan anymore. Now it's an army of bloopers. That it still doesn't explain where the fuck they came from. <laughs> yeah. Or what they are. Or if the one girl survived. Why is there suddenly more? I don't know, but credits now, I guess. Are those things aliens, or just... Uh, I don't know if... Maybe they're the Skelters? I I don't fucking know. <laughs> yeah, who's Skelter and who is Heaven? Uh, I don't know. I feel like rather than the credits, we should just go back to more... Bo more pilot Flex. training? So we can yeah, learn to be more, Bo more Bowflex pilot trainer. I feel like if they could grow a human pilot, why didn't they just grow a Godzilla-sized pilot to go punch right, the Right, just alien? have them go, yeah. just go punch him in the face? Yeah, why, why bother... Like building robots, or one of these things is more complex than the other. <laughs> if you can grow pilots, why the fuck are your mechs so shit? <laughs> yeah, I think they're made by two different companies. So look at it, like open source that shit. Look fuck at it. just grown a giant <laughs> foot that goes out there and kicks squid. They could build a giant barbecue and just stick it under the squid. <laughs> Robotic barbecue. Yes. Then make giant calamari. <laughs> <laughs> giant calamari for a year, Timmy. That's Skelter Heaven. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you next time. Adios, test subjects. Yeah.